People love a good detective story. From Sir Conan Arthur Doyle's iconic Sherlock Holmes to the behavioral analysis unit on criminal minds, detectives and investigators are all over our popular culture. But what does it take to be a good detective? Let's find out. First, you have to be observant. You have to be able to see details about what is around you. Not only must you see details, you must remember and draw conclusions from them. Tan face, but no tan above the wrists. You've been abroad, but not sunbathing. Your haircut and the way you hold yourself says military. Your conversation when you entered the room. Uh, a bit different from my day. Says trained at Bart, so army doctor, obviously. Secondly, you need a good sidekick. Sherlock has Watson, Sean has Gus. You can even have an entire team behind you, like Temperance Brennan and her team at the Jeffersonian. Brennan! Hey, Todgins. Your victim was in some other tunnel system before she died. Facts before conclusions, please. Her clothing shows traces of diamond dust. That suggests a much older system of tunnels than the one in which you found her. Industrial diamonds were used in blast hole drilling in the 19th century. Near a vault. Makes sense. Good job, Hodgins. What would we do without you? Lastly, you need a mystery. You need some sort of crime or unexplained situation to grab your attention and get your team into action. Alright, so the names that gave us, they're all couples? Three different couples all went missing. And they're all from different towns, different states? And that's right, yeah, Washington, New York, Colorado. Each couple took a road trip cross-country. None of them arrived at their destination. None of them ever heard from again. That's a big country, Dean. They could have disappeared anywhere. Yeah, could have. But each one's route took them to the same part of Indiana. Always on the second week of April. One year after another after another. This is the second week of April. Yep. Once you have all of these elements, it's time to gather the evidence, weigh the possibilities, and get to the bottom of whatever mystery is afoot. And before you know it, You've just become the star of your very own detective story. And that means you, sir, 